Welcome to Megger's video training series. In this video, I will show an example of how to use the fault calculator. The fault calculator is a powerful tool which is available in the home screen, it is available in the ramping screen, and in the state simulator. I will say in the home screen for this example. There are several modes of operation. It can operate in overcurrent, voltage, frequency, impedance, symmetrical components, power swing, and fault location modes. I will be using the impedance mode for this example. For this example, the SMRT46 is connected to an impedance relay. The zone 1 setting is 6.24 ohms. I will perform a manual pickup test. Using a fault calculator, I will set a three-phase fault using constant voltage. Pre-fault healthy current will be 1 amp. The setting is 6.24 ohms. I will set something slightly larger than that, 6.35 ohms at 85 degrees. When I accept these values, the amplifiers will be configured for the test. Notice the fault values are now 9.4 amps at 60 volts. Pre-fault is 1 amp at nominal angles. I will set a pre-fault time of 3 seconds. Select each amplifier which is intended to come on. As I do, Notice the fault type is displayed for me. The impedance, voltage, and current is being displayed. Because this is a manual pickup test, I do not want to have the auto off turned on, nor do I want it to latch. And I need to configure my ramp. Set three phase ramp, accept the change, Hit the master on button. Switch to fault. I can now begin using my wheel mouse to ramp. Notice the contact actuation as I approach 6.24 ohms. This concludes the demonstration of the fault calculator. Thank you for your time.